Hey folks, Mr. Dell here. We are uh, looking at a percent um, question. So a rate that we want to uh, apply to a word problem. So this is finding the percent of something. Uh, this is going to come from CPM's course two. And this is section, as we see it right there, 7.1.4 and number 745. So it says, Mr. Anderson's doctor has advised him to go on a diet. He must reduce his caloric intake by 15%. Okay? He currently eats 2,800 calories per day. Calculate his new daily caloric intake rate in two different ways. Use two different multipliers. So I've got two things I can do. I know he currently has, he's consuming 2,800 calories per day. But we want to know what will what he what he needs to in have his new intake be his new rate of per day like how much he should eat per day how many calories per day and he needs to reduce it by fifteen percent so two things I can do one would be to take fifteen percent of two thousand eight hundred come up with that answer right whatever that's going to be. Then from there, take that and subtract it from 2,800, and that would be my answer, right? So it's take 15% of this, get that, then subtract it from 2,800, and that's going to be my new rate. That's one way. The other way is if we already know that he needs to reduce it by 80, by 15%, then what he needs, he needs to do he needs to only take in 85% of this amount. And if I do 85% of this amount, that's actually going to get me right to my answer. Instead of having to do 15%, then subtract and get the answer, I can just do 85% and get the answer right, out, right off there. So I'm going to do both ways so we can see that. So first of all, 15% of 2,800. Remember, in order to do this type of math here, you got to have a multiplier, right? We've got to use a multiplier. My multiplier in this case is always either a fraction or a percent, right? So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and use a fraction because it's going to um, keep my numbers nice. So I'm going to say to do this math, I'll do it here. I'm going to go 15 over 100 because you always put a percent over 100. And I'm going to multiply that times 2,800, right? And when you do that, you put the 2,800 over 1. And then what's nice here is if you notice this, that this 100 and 2800 can simplify because 100 goes into 2800 28 times. So I can cross simplify before I multiply. So really all I got to do is take 15 times 28. Okay, So 15 times 28, we can do that however uh, is necessary. Um, so 15 times 28. is 420. So we know that he needs to he needs to reduce his caloric intake by 420 calories. So now I just take 280, 200, 2800 and subtract 420 and that gives me 2380. Okay? So he needs to take in 3 2380 calories. That's his new um daily caloric intake so that was one way is again finding 15 percent getting that number then subtracting it from the previous total or over here i can do 85 percent. so 85 percent of that remember and I'll, I'll do this one i did this one as a fraction i'll do this one as a decimal so my multiplier here is going to be 0.85 and i'm going to multiply that times 2800 right so when you multiply decimals uh, remember, you're multiplying the numbers and then making sure your final answer has uh, enough of the decimal digits as you do that multiplication. And for that, I'm going to get, um, again, that should give you 2,380 calories. And that's exactly what we had before. So we get the same answer, just two different ways of getting there. Okay. There we go.